My daughter is younger than me and a female. All she is good for being is in the kitchen. Bad. It's 2022. Stop treating Alicia like this, please. It's so embarrassing, honestly. Especially when you talk to her like this, like she's lower than you when my friends are over constantly. My father taught me this way, and this is the right way. Dad, you so manic, absolutely insane. You always ask why does Alicia hate you? This is why you are psycho towards her constantly. I can't even bear to stand by as you're acting like this. I do not understand where you are coming from. I think you need to listen to the Wesh and Lit. Wesh and Lit? That ignorant alpha male po behavior podcast? Oh, please, Dad. I'm getting a lesson on a snack. I can't even put up with you. Alicia, what are you doing sitting on this couch? I need you to get into the kitchen and go cook your brother and I some dinner. Maybe you can have some if you listen to Wesh and Lit, the best podcast ever. Dad, I'm not going to go to the kitchen and go cook you some food. You have two arms yourself, you know. How dare you try to sass me. Now you're going to get up and get your little behind in the kitchen. Because this is honestly insane. No, no, go. You're on my spot. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Dad wants some dinner, huh? Good thing I've been watching Gordon Ramsay. I'll show him what some real dinner is. <sighs> oh my god. Dad, I still don't think it's right what you did to Alicia. Like, come on. I think it's right. Everything I say is always right. No, no, no. Why are you thinking that way, Dad? And you're having her in the kitchen, in the kitchen, making dinner for us now? You can't even use your, use your hands and help her, Dad. What is this? Come on. Because it's a female in my kitchen, you ding-dong head. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't get all mad at me, Dad. Stop huffing and puffing. Are you going to come blow my house down? A chocolate bar and Coca-Cola? This is what I call dinner. Just add in the Coca-Cola and done. Dad is sure going to be happy about this. Oh no, what are you doing? Dad is already furious. He's just going to become more mad at you. This is what he deserves. No one should be treated the way he treats me. I know, I'm trying to knock some sense into him, but he has no brain to know how he's like. Tell me about it. I, I hear him coming. Alicia, Dad's coming. So I'm gonna wait for Alicia right now. Alicia, how dare you do this inside of my kitchen? I absolutely hate you. You and your mother are absolutely useless. Why couldn't you have just been born to be a son? A man to a man in America is what we need. You women are absolutely useless. Son, get in my room. Son, you know absolutely nothing about a relationship. The man is supposed to lead in a relationship, otherwise it won't work. Not even one little bit. Now for you, Alicia, I am not nearly done with you. <laughs> Alicia, go start cleaning. This is just part one of your punishment. <laughs> I can't believe Dad continues to treat me like this every single day. I've been cleaning this house forever, and there's just absolutely nothing I can do to get away from him. Oh my god, this makes me so sad. Hey, Alicia, can I talk to you for a moment? What do you want? You're the last person I want to see. Please, Alicia. I'm, I'm trying to knock some sense into Dad. Knock some sense into him? How can he have sense even in him? He has absolutely no brain. Trust me, I understand, Alicia. But I'm trying my best. I'm trying my hardest. There's absolutely nothing that I, I'm not trying to do. You know what? You're the last person I want to see. Get away from me. I wish you were born a girl. I wish you were my sister. Then Dad wouldn't treat me this way at all. Please, Alicia, I'm taking away the podcast from him. He's just absolutely manic. You know what? Leave me alone. Goodbye.
Dad, the car must have broken down. I have absolutely no way of how to fix a broken down car. A male? I have a bad back and can't get under the Jeep. Not this again. I thought you learned from Dr. Meek. I'm sorry, but this car is broken down. We have places to be, and neither of us can fix this car. <gasps> I think I know someone who actually can, and you actually know them, Dad. Who? My sister, your daughter, Alicia. She knows all about cars. She knows about everything, Dad. I don't think she'll be happy helping me. Dad, she's Alicia. She's your daughter, and she knows right from wrong. I can just give her a call. A call? I haven't seen her in years. Time you see her, own up to your stuff. What you did her in the past. Trust me, she loves you and she always will. You just made some very, very bad mistakes. I know. I made mistakes. I'll do anything to take back what I said to her. I should have never treated you two so different. Never too late to change that. Trust me, we all get on bad paths sometimes. It's just about how we handle the situation. Sometimes when you feel like the puzzle is all falling apart, Sometimes, everything is just all coming together. Thank you. Mention to her on the call. I'm here, please. Yes, of course. I'm gonna just go give her a call. Alright, I'll wait. Hey, Alicia, are you busy right now? Well, I'm at the hospital working. I'm about to see a patient in roughly half an hour. But what's up? Well, I'm with Dad right now. Dad? You're with Dad? Yeah. We're heading to an appointment, and the car just completely broke down. It's the Jeep from when we were little. Oh my gosh, I always told him to get rid of that Jeep, but he would never listen to me, of course. Oh my god, Alicia. But he has gotten better. He started a doctor. He's doing better now. But we just really, really need your help. Okay, what street are you on? We're in Brookhaven. Brookhaven? Give me a moment. I'll be here. Thank God you're here, Alicia. Yeah, of course. I mean, I was in the middle of seeing a patient, but anything for you guys. Okay, so tell me exactly what's going on. The car literally just broke down, and I have no idea how you fix cars, and Dash is complaining about his back constantly. Okay, you guys have a two box. Here, move out of my way and I'm going to open up the Jeep. I'm going to see exactly what's wrong. I have some tools in my car from work and I am going to fix this. Thank you. Okay, Dad, I'm going to need to step out. It's good to see you, Alicia. Good to see you too, Dad. But I need to focus on fixing this vehicle first. Okay, let me see exactly what's wrong. Ah, it's in the engine and you need an oil change. Here, I have some oil in my work car. I'll just completely fix it. It will be ready in no time. Son, can you please give Elisa and I a moment? I just need to talk to her. Thank you. Uh, Alicia. Oh, uh, where do I even start? Alicia, I just want to apologize for these past few years, for how I treated you, for not messaging you, for not checking on you. I am your father, I should have been there for you, but instead, I was a sexist male. I was just being influenced by awful, awful men. I mean, they're not even men for thinking of women that way. Dad, you went down a rabbit hole. But yes, you should have messaged me. You should have reached out to me. I am your daughter and I have suffered being treated this way for years. But I'm thriving in life right now without your help. I have a wonderful, wonderful gentleman I'm with and I am a medical doctor. That is absolutely amazing, Alicia. I am so proud of you. I hope I can meet this gentleman anytime soon. How does dinner sound with your brother and I? Sunday night, maybe? That actually sounds really good, Dad. I'll be looking forward towards that. But I have to get back to the hospital. Get there safe. It was nice seeing you. I'll message you later tonight. Who knew Alicia had that many talents?
never just anyone i'm so glad my daughter accepted my apology and that we are on better paths now make sure you guys like subscribe and comment down below comfy sunny is reading all comments yes i am reading all comments bye guys i love you <laughs>